setting up the galley with the G, JLN network. Got the clay thrower. We're gonna be doing a video, shoot, review. Setting up, we got targets. We're gonna shoot some water. You know what I'm saying? And uh, show y'all how we get down, man. You dig? What's in your holster? Click, click. Man. All right, we're on the range as promised with the Stoger M3000 Freedom Series that I made prettier. Say click, click, bang if you are. Leave a comment, click, click, bang if you are. And we got the merchandise coming, so y'all need to stay tuned for that. All right, so here we go. What's up, world? It's me, Gary with the G. We're at Pinal County uh, Public Shooting Range and we're going over the Stoga M3000 Defense Freedom Series Shotgun. It is a beauty. It is fun to shoot. Before we start though, we're going to do our normal safety check. As you can see, the action is open and clear. There's nothing in the chamber and there is nothing in the magazine. Now that we cleared it, we're going to go over what this comes with. So normally this comes with a stock. This one is a plastic stock with a comfortable rubberized grip. Has a smooth trigger on this. It's really smooth. It's not clicky. It's not spongy. Has a smooth trigger. Has a Picatinny rail. It has a polymer handguard. It's about 40 plus inches overall length with an 18.5 inch barrel so you can take this to your clay shooting range and shoot this just as well as any other because it is in spec with the 18.5 inch barrel it has a red bar front sight and it has a ghost sight ghost ring sight in the back i'll show you there it is which is pretty accurate right out the box like right out the box it's already zeroed and i didn't have to touch it the only thing i did do to this is i put that jewelry on there you guys know i love my jewelry on my my weapon so i went with my moa precision all of these can be purchased at moa position that i'm about to tell you they don't pay me for that i'm just letting you know i'm sharing i'm sharing what i know so you can have your firearm if you like this just as fine has a two plus extension normally it just comes with a five round magazine but we added a two plus anodized red extension we added a charging handle that's red oversized so you can easily grab red anodized charger handle it and an oversized mag drop or mag release right there and on the inside i'm gonna drop it now and show you on the inside there's that follower that red anodized follower so all in all it's semi-automatic uh, as you know that there are shotguns that are semi-automatic there's shotguns that's one shot there's shotguns that's pump action and there's shotguns that's a smaller a smaller caliber a real smaller caliber caliber and we will show you that coming up we'll bring out this on the range and we'll bring a guest out to show you another firearm that's a shotgun that might blow you away and we did do a review on it uh earlier so you check for that video till then y'all tune in and i'll see you on the range None look like they survived. None survived. Uh -uh, Safety uh -uh. on. So, take a look. Yeah, that, that wouldn't survive. That's why this is such a good self-defense shotgun. I wouldn't mind having this in my house, would you? Still standing, blowing a smithereen. This one lost its bottom, trying to get away, and it couldn't. Now, I want, I want to make a public service announcement. These ranges that's free to use, you guys need to keep it clean. 
so we can continue to utilize these BML lines. We're gonna start taking it away if we don't keep it clean. So after we finish here today, we will be cleaning up after ourselves so the next person can have fun on the range just like we are today, getting out practicing. Now we're gonna step over here, Mr. Abominable Snowman, see what we can do to him. All right, weapon's hot. Open and clear. Clear. All right. Put that down for now. Let's go over and see what happened to Mr. Obama the snowman over there. Whew. I stay there. Hello. Is anybody home? Yeah, he would not make it out here in the desert. So he could tell his friends, you come out here. That's what you in for. His other buddy, he all over the place. Now, interesting thing with the, that one eighth uh, ounce bird shot, you see how many pellets is all over the place? But if you look closely, there were eight shots that also contributed to the damage that this thing did for him. So, look at that. That was two shots, put a hole right through him. Make a little finger puppet. All right, so what you guys think about that? I think that was funny. I want to see some more. I'm gonna put three in there. I think I could do it with three shots. That's three. Weapons up. We're hot. That's three bad guys gone. Action open and it's clear. All right, how you guys like that? That was cool, that felt good. Would you want this in your house to protect you and your loved ones? I would. I love shooting it as a sport and for self-defense. It feels good, I could keep it out, I could bring it in. It's not that much recoil on it where I can't control it with the stock on my on my shoulder like this. I can still control it with the stock if I have to get in tighter areas. Or I can uh, aim down. This, I know that people say, no point and shoot. We're gonna test that theory. I'm not gonna aim, I'm just gonna point and shoot and see what it hits. We're gonna test that theory out. Let's test it out now. Let's, let's take a look at Mr. Abominable Snowman over there. He has a hole in him. This time I'm not gonna try and aim. I'm just gonna point and shoot. And we're locked and loaded. I'm pointing and shooting now. Oh, locked and loaded. Weapon clear. Go down. I didn't try and aim at all. So, there is some pellets on both sides. As you can see where the pellets hit, this one, the hole, one of the shots hit here, but a lot was still on target. This one, he took a clean head shot. So it's pretty accurate without even pointing, without even aiming, just a point and shoot. And the reason I said that is because it's dark at night, you want to make sure who's around, of course, but if you know that there's a threat in close proximity, you may not have time to get on target. With one of these, you get in the area and you shoot. Ready? close it out I told you I had something special for you 
if you guys can remember we got another shotgun that we're going to shoot today and that shotgun is going to be dun, 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 the Taurus Public Defender this one we're going to start with the Winchester half ounce nine shot we're going to see how the Public Defender half ounce nine shot Winchester Let's look at it real quick. So as you can see, this may not be good. Let me make sure it went all the way through. Yeah, they all went through paper, but this is not the round that I may per se want at my bedside. One slug followed by two round balls. And we're gonna see what that does on paper. Stand by. Let's load that up. All right, weapon hot. see the difference all the bird shot from the half ounce and these left holes in the intended target and that's what we want holes permanent holes left in the target that's gonna go all the way through another shotgun this is just a handheld version versus the Stoga M3000 thank you guys for subscribing for liking for sharing these videos we do this for you so I want you guys to leave me a comment below. Let me know what you think of that Stoga M3000. Let me know what you think about that Taurus Defense. Would you keep that in your holster? Till next time, this is Gary with the G. We signing out, click, click, bang.